Another victim of sexual harassment at workplace breaks her silence. Yet again, it involves members of the prosecution office, making this the second such account coming from an organization that's home to the so-called elite in the nation. The government is taking strong action to prevent such horrific encounters. Park Hye-jun gets us up to speed with the developments. Following the testimony of Prosecutor Seo Ji-hyun, who was a victim of sexual assault within the prosecution office, more victims are coming forward, further kindling the worldwide Me Too movement in Korea. Lee Moon Jung, a prosecutor at the Seoul Northern Prosecutor's Office, also came forward and shared her traumatic experience. She said she was a victim of sexual assault twice in 2003 and in 2005 by her superiors. Upon reporting the assaults, she was verbally abused and her career suffered a great deal. The stories of Seo and Im were not the first, nor will they be the last cases of harassment and assault that women suffer in private firms, the film industry, and even public offices on a daily basis. Women have spoken before, many times for that matter, and seems like for once, the voice of victims have been heard and received the necessary spotlight to prompt the government to take strong action. During a meeting with his top officials on Monday, President Moon Jae-in said the cases of sexual misconduct were not handled appropriately and asked officials to make their utmost efforts to prevent such behavior from taking place at the workplace again. Following the president's remark, Prime Minister Lee nak on Tuesday called for a thorough probe into all the allegations, calling the harassment cases at the prosecution office the agency's worst crisis. I believe this is the prosecution's worst ever crisis. I ask the prosecution staking its honor, no, even its existence, to find out the truth about these accusations and take appropriate action. He also ordered the Gender Equality Ministry and other relevant government offices to spare no effort to prevent victims or whistleblowers from being retaliated against and to investigate all cases of sexual misconduct at government and public organizations. Park Hee-jun, Arirang News.